And, well, this is weird. So, get in the vet. Here, this void starting up towards carbon on the door jams. Back in this thing. I know it needs gas. I left it here with no gas, so. Yep, it needs gas. Look how low Wait. on gas this boy is, yo. Like, this thing is low. Look at this. Dude, the needle didn't even move when I turned it off. Like, that needle did not move when I freaking turned it off. No freaking way. And we have gas now. About over half tank, but we good. $40, we good. <laughs> That's all I had in my pocket, and we in the city type. I'm not using my card in the car thing in the city. Mm -hmm. What's the Dilio Martilio, y'all? So I know um, some of you guys are wondering and waiting, like, why am I back in the Corvette? I thought it was so well, without going into too much of detail, but I can still go into detail. I was selling it off consignment, and well, it didn't sell. I guess it wasn't pushed or anything to be sold then. So um, here we are today. As soon as I come back from California, we get. I go get the bed, but. Um, I don't know I don't know where to start with this you know I, I don't know where to start I do want to say mm, I, I just don't know what to say we just had to come back we picked up the bet we got a lot going on now so far, you know what I'm saying so if you haven't subscribed subscribe and turn on post notifications because we literally we got a lot going on so we got to pick up the bet and then we have a road trip to where the bet is going where it is finding a new home and all I can say is shout out to the team because, well, um, everything works out differently and I, I just don't know what to say. Like, we bought the How about mom trying to race me? Like, nah, let me relax. I ate all my food. And me and my mom went out to eat. It's literally, we gotta eat something every time I get back. So, that, that's just how I be. But I don't want to get copyrighted, so. My mom paying the bill because I just came back and I spent all my money in California, so. Whatever. So, a lot of you are probably wondering, why is the Corvette back? And I know I didn't explain this before, but I guess I can explain it a little bit now. But welcome back to Michigan, where it is officially March now. My birthday is March 7th, so make sure you guys stay tuned to that because you already know we will... I think that'll explain a little bit. So the Corvette is back for a reason. It was being sold on consignment and stuff. And you know, as a business, the YouTube is my business. I run on a timeline. And well, all I can say is the timeline wasn't being met in a little miscommunication, I guess you could say, or whatever. So I went and picked up the Corvette. So now here we have the Corvette here because I did pay, I had to pay a car note, pay the insurance and stuff, and there was no point in it sitting in a dealership, especially when things weren't going the right way and the deadlines weren't being met. So I went back with my team, which this, I really like, honestly, when I think about it, I have an official, unofficial team. So I want to say thank you to my team. So I went back with the team and we literally like sorted everything out in one day. So like I was saying, like way, way before I want to do one more road trip in the Corvette, well, that that that's happening so this thing is going somewhere else it is going to one of the carolinas is all i'ma say you guys will just have to watch and see the next video to see which one all that stuff come along on a road trip all that because well that thing is officially officially getting sold and the new car is coming which is en route by the way if i said too much oh well my bad yeah so this is Probably the last time seeing a Corvette here in the garage like this. It is a little dirty, but it is winter. We'll pull this out because we're about to go get food anyway. Um, yeah. So you guys do still have the opportunity to buy the Corvette if you want. It just won't be in Michigan. It will be, well, down in South Carolina. I, I'll just say it anyway. It will be down in South Carolina. You guys remember where I got the AMG? 
yeah it's sort of that way and if you guys want me to go more in depth than that that's like a behind the scenes type of business type of thing well, not my business but like a behind the scenes on what goes on and all that stuff if you guys do want to hear about that just comment down below and let me know and i might let you guys know in a future video but yep so that's basically that so round everything up is timeline was it going right i didn't feel right paying all this stuff on a corvette just for it to be sitting somewhere and just not being productive so i went picked the corvette up me and my team figured something out in a day i'll drop it off to them down there they buy that so it's basically a trade-in because the team the team owns a dealership so it's basically a trade-in that's the only hint you guys are getting right now that's basically the only hint you guys are getting so you know what a trade-in you save on taxes all that ah yeah that's the only hint you guys are getting so you guys are just gonna have to stay tuned for that and just we'll just enjoy the vet for the little time we have it back tomorrow and here we go a different traveling bag because well it's road trip time road trip and now let's start the bet. Don't forget forged carbon on the door jam. So Ma, can you tell them I'm, I'm not wearing this for no reason. Make sure I'm gonna make this, look, this video right here, Ma, this is gonna be like a euphoria episode. It's just gonna be a straight banger. So make sure you get your leftovers, reheat your, well, reheat your leftovers, yeah. get your noodles, noodles, make noodles, all that stuff, because this video is a banger. So today, get your coffee. I have a road trip. My mom isn't coming. But I am not coming. It looked like I am, but I am not. Yeah, we, <laughs> Have a road trip today, which I think I will explain more at the gas station. So love you, mom. Love you, Josh. So I gotta uh, gotta get gas, you know, road trip stuff, you know. Yeah, you so. know, roll all the road trips, get your snacks, uh, get your, you know, yeah. your tea, you know. Your oh, I forgot about that. Mike and Ike. There you go. You know, all, you know, all your stuff you gotta get. There you go. I like that. I'm saying bye bye to the Corvette. Bye Corvette. It's been good. Wonderful sharing my space with you. Um, Done what you were supposed to do. We so appreciate you. We love you. Thank you. Me and my son to his destination safely. But uh bigger and better, what can I say? No, that that's pretty dramatic. So right now y'all we are heading up to the gas station because of course I, I gotta get gas. This thing, of course, you know what I'm saying? I gotta get gas. So that was your final goodbyes, mom, to the movie. That's why, yeah, uh, you know. Yeah. yeah. Bigger and better, guess what, mom? What? You, so it's a type of muscle on your arm that's gonna get some workout that you really don't because you don't use the upward motion a lot. That's why I bought those weights. Yeah, you see? Know, this so you're gonna get that, yeah, that muscle. There you go, yeah, that motion right there. So that's how you open the door, you know, instead of like, you know, just like that. You see, that's, that's where this comes in. Yeah. You're working, you working right here where you, you know what I'm saying? Oh, like up, okay. Like so I need to, instead of this, I need to be going out. Yeah. I need to like be doing that. this. Yeah. See, Upper like body that. Okay. So work, work on that. The door, the door is a little heavy. Yeah. We have made it to the gas station because we do need some gas. And it is Shell V Power, which I barely put in the AMG, but it got the logo on there. I don't know why is that. Now, all we need is road trip. And the manina and the nemonies. And then you'll bubble this. I think we can get a water too, just to be safe. Like when we get closer to pulling over type, you know. And then. And, uh, there we go. Now we got this and walk back out to the vet last time in Michigan. Isn't that sad? This is the vet's last time in Michigan, but it's okay. We move on bigger and better stuff. Grind on stop to the mm -mm casket drop. Shout out to Slim, man. But look at it, last time in Michigan. So now let's see how far we have to go. And as you look on here, we have a nine hour, 46 minute drive. I looked last night, it was nine hours and 20, so that's a little bit of traffic, but hopefully we don't hit traffic. Back the van up. Sheesh. Wait for it, wait for it. We got a full tank. Oh yeah, and sorry if I didn't mention where we're heading to. We are heading down to North Carolina right now. We're going to Charlotte, 
North Carolina. So any of you guys see me in Charlotte and stuff, that, that's just where I am. So North Carolina, nine hours away. We are meeting up with my agent Evans as well. So anyways, enough talking. We gotta we gotta hit the road. Hit the road. Hit the road, Jack, and don't come back. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. First gas stop. So we have traveled far because now it is 60 degrees. Oh man, it feels good. L li listen to that. So since I'm at a BP, this is confusing. The black is diesel and the green is regular. Now, does that make freaking sense? Nope, but I guess it's just BP and how BP does it. Well, the sign on the door says no public restroom and I have to pee. So while this is pumping gas, we're just gonna Come to Bob Evans. <laughs> okay, now I feel freaking refreshed. Thank you to Bob Evans. I knew I should have kept going. I have 87 miles left, and let's see how far we are. But first, we got $60 on the full tank, which isn't too bad when you're used to California. <laughs> but anyways, close that up, and now let's look at this. We are five hours and 11 minutes away so i think we're making pretty good time you know i feel like it's pretty good time i will go inside and get snacks but they don't have a public restroom so you know that kind of disappointed me i'm just here for gas at this point anyways let's hop back in the back look how just look how barely that clears it start the vet up let's see how many miles we got Sheesh, this thing sounds good and amazing i'll be happy for the next person who gets it because this thing is worth it. What the heck is that thing playing? Anyways, before you copyright me, 400 miles. Okay, I know it's low. Oh my gosh, I know I connected. 400 miles to E, and we are 327 miles away. So. I'm pretty sure we can make it. I think I think we can make this one. So I was complaining about this road at first just because it's like, it's not like a freeway. I've been on a lot of back country roads, if you can tell in the cinematics and stuff. It's not like a freeway at all. But I was complaining at first, but now since I'm like more out of like, it's like a freeway slash road type or whatever, it's low-key pretty chill. I, I kind of like it now, but when we get that, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna just keep teasing y'all until we get to it, man. But I ain't, I'm not wearing this coat for nothing. So it'd be nice in the McLaren or whatever. So anyways, y'all, let's hit back on the road on the way to North Carolina, Charlotte. Fire shark. What the f is that? Hey, yo, bubble. So here we are at a toll, which I went through one. I don't have any money on me, and we're in West Virginia, so I guess they, they never came up with the process of using cards at tolls, so it's cash on Two tolls in a row. Been pretty easy so far. Um, 
have made it. The vet has made it to North Carolina. Now I am very hungry and exhausted. So let's, let's open this up right here. So, oh crap, I got two backpacks. Let's see how I'm gonna do this. Now, now I wanna get stuck. Come on, dude. You know, the most unnecessary stuff happen when you like tired and not in the mood. But anyways, watch this. So I'm touch. <sighs> anyways. And here is my room. Looks really good. I walk in, I'm like, dang, look at this dude. This is like a living room right here. Oh my gosh, this room looks freaking good, but Okay, enough of the room, y'all. I'm literally exhausted and I'm freaking starving. I feel like this video is super duper extra long, but oh well, we'll be all right. Oh man, I'm starving. We're getting food and watch where we end up at. And we ended up at Cheesecake Factory, but um, thanks for all y'all for finish this. And we are back at the hotel. It is nighttime, so this video is gonna be a two-part series, but you guys do know why. Well, you guys don't really know, but I did explain a little bit why the Corvette is back. So the Corvette is back, but we are here now in Charlotte, North Carolina. Did our last road trip in the vet. It's all dirty, so we might have to watch that tomorrow. So stay tuned for the next video. But um, it's a two-part series, and once you see, I don't want to spoil you too much until the final video, which is the next video, and you guys will just see everything. Like I said earlier, I'm not wearing my jacket for no reason so that should be a big enough hint but i hope you guys did enjoy this video if you did go down and smash that like button then subscribe and turn on post notifications so you don't miss any more bangers because all 2022 we're going up y'all i ain't gonna cap and this is literally honestly just the beginning just make sure you turn on post notifications after this because you don't want to miss it i promise i'm gonna catch you on the next one peace